Hey y'all, uh, what's up? It's your girl Kwani and welcome back to my channel. So it has been another three weeks, three weeks of trying to lose weight, three weeks of weighing in, and I am about to upload three more weigh-ins for you guys. Um, these three weeks, I don't even know what to say. Honestly, it's been hard. Like, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, it's been hard. Um, I did have the little, I don't even know what to call it. Basically, my weight kind of stalled and was doing weird stuff for a very long time. Um, y'all know, or I have shared with y'all what happened with my first son and how, um, I'm sorry, I'm trying not to talk loud because I think I hear an echo. If y'all hear that, can y'all like let me know because then I'll record somewhere else. But anyways, um, y'all know with my first son, I basically gave up right after I had him because I was trying to lose weight and it went good. Well, it didn't go good. Basically, my weight was just like, no matter what I was doing, my weight was like going up ounces and yeah, I just didn't know what was wrong with it. Basically, that's what happened within these three weeks. It's like everything was going good, then all of a sudden everything like stalled. And um, sometimes I do weigh myself in the middle of the week to make sure I'm doing what I'm supposed to do and my weight is heading in the right direction and everything. And so I weighed myself and yeah, like I think I was like up some weight, not a lot, but I was up some and I was just like, what? Like, that can't be because I've been working out like crazy. I've been eating right, eating everything I'm supposed to be eating. So, how can I be up weight, even if it's not a lot, even if it is some ounces to a pound or whatever? How? So, then from there, I started, like, documenting everything I was eating. I started working out, getting in a certain amount of steps every day. And I would step on a scale every morning before I ate anything. And I was be going up ounces. And I was just like, what the heck? And it was starting to be very frustrating to me. Um, I told myself, like, y'all know from my last video, I told myself that if this started happening to me, I wasn't going to give up like I did with my after I had my first son. I was going to stick through it and hopefully my body starts to react in a better way. Um, but it was hard. You know, I'm not going to lie. You know, it was times where I would be sitting there like, I might as well just go get some fast food or something because what's the purpose? Like, I'm doing all of this and I'm gaining weight. Like, what's the purpose? But, but I had to basically keep telling myself, like... Just keep going. Your body going to catch up to what you're doing. Um, you going to start making progress. You just had a baby. Like, I literally, y'all, I literally just became six weeks. Like, I'm like, six weeks, like, four days now, I want to say. Um, so, yeah, I just kept telling myself, like, you just had a baby. Your body is still healing. Your body is going through hormonal changes. Um, what else? Um, also, I realized a little after that, that, uh, my lady time had came, which I think a lot of women have issues with their weight going up or fluctuating a little bit before they start their menstrual or, um, you know, while they're on it. So I'm like, okay, well, maybe that's the issue, you know, along with I'm still healing and, my body is still going through things and trying to get back to normal. Maybe that's what was wrong too. I was about to start my lady time and yeah, it messed with my weight like it always do. So, um, yeah, just know that every ounce of weight that I have lost, I worked super, super hard for it. And honestly, y'all, I'm so proud of myself. Like, I don't, oh my goodness. Sometimes I wish I could, like, show y'all every part of 
my life because it's just like y'all wouldn't even believe how amazing I've been doing and how I haven't given up. This is literally the first time that the scale haven't been doing what I feel like it should be doing and I didn't give up. Like typically when it happens, I just be like, forget it, I'm about to eat what I want and I give up. But this was has literally been the first time that that has happened and I haven't given up at all. This has been the first time, I don't know, yeah, I'm just proud of myself. Y'all don't even know, <laughs> y'all don't know at all. I'm just real, real proud of myself. And every day I'm making better food choices. And one thing I kept telling myself where my weight wasn't going my way was, you know, maybe, you know, because I'm going through things inside of my body, trying to get back to normal. Maybe my weight, the scale isn't going the way that I want it to go. But I know I'm making some positive changes on the inside of my body with the way I have been eating. I've eaten more vegetables than I've eaten in so long. I've eaten more fruits than I've eaten in so long. Y'all, I haven't snacked like every every now and then i may have a bag of chips but it's to the point where i don't even crave chips no more at this point i'm still craving some things but i don't even crave chips at this point no more um i got chips one time and they was just blah like it was i don't know y'all it's just it's it's so awesome so I'm not trying to talk y'all ear off. I don't want this video to be long, but I'm really proud of myself. And like I said, every ounce of weight that I have lost, I fought for. And so I'm proud of the weight that I am now. I do feel like I should be a little lower, but um, with everything that has happened, with me just having a baby, my body trying to get back to normal, my lady time coming back, I am really, really proud of myself. So, yeah, without further ado, I am going to insert my weigh-ins here. And I guess that'll be the end of the video. So, I hope y'all have a day. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I hope y'all have a good day um, or night whenever y'all watching this. And, yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Deuces. Hello. It's ready. Hello. It's ready. 409.4 pounds.